Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I am back home from my vacation now, and we will be trying to get back to these daily uploads. Uh, so today we're back here in the GT spec series. I'll let you guys know right off the rip that we are not on the pace. Uh, combination of being out of practice and trying a new tune and any other racing driver excuses I can come up with. Um, had we qualified we would have qualified an eighth about well maybe even a little bit faster but we ran a 146.2 in practice before the track was fully rubbered in um instead we're starting back here in p15 of 19 because i'm off the pace i'm going to be running hards and just see how far i can go uh like i said i'm trying a new tune designed by jh clamp god this design is sick so I will show it to you guys, but uh, let's go ahead and hop in and see how we do. Alright, look at that. Doesn't that look nice? Look at that. Just looks so good. Alright. Uh, I did want to go ahead and thank you guys real quick um, for you know being understanding and stuff while I went out of town come on dude um, but yeah I, I appreciate all y'all's kind words and patience and everything um, it's really nice to see so thank you guys for that um, this Ferrari is annoying dude Alright, we're up here into 12. Something happened behind, that guy was right in front of us. Sorry if I seem a little kind of all over the place in this race. I'm <laughs> trying to get back into the swing of things here. It's also one o'clock in the morning because uh, I got stuck with a very incompetent airline today and uh, wound up dragging out what should have been like four hours of flying into a 13 hour ordeal. So anyway, I digress. go ahead and try to hunt down this expo here so I know we have the pace on him he's just kind of in the way like that Ferrari up there has been for a while Bro, come on. I'm 
might do hard to soft. We'll have to see how that goes. top 10 there's some people off we do have this Audi right on our butt here I want to try to build a little bit of a gap to them it's kind of hard on these hard tires whoa looks decent I don't know if a no stop is possible but might be someone already pit there here on lap 4 sitting in P10 as a result of that pit stop Finally catching back up to this Ferrari here that was causing so many problems. back into a fight with the Audi here because of his little tussle with that Ferrari you need to leave me more room dude What an idiot, dude. <laughs> Alright, we're up here into P8. We got this crossbow GT2 bearing down on us. Probably gonna be an idiot going into this corner. Thankfully not. I was a little worried with how quickly he was closing that, that he might, uh try some crazy up the inside move there but thank you Richard KCL for not doing that all right well as soon as I said something huh couldn't help yourself could you Here into sixth place now on lap five. Tires are starting to go. So I think we might do 
seven on hards and two on softs. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. Uh-oh, someone's off right there. Oh, that's a back marker, okay. All right, up here into second place now. Although I'm sure it's temporary, I think I don't know, maybe we won't. I feel like we're gonna have to hit at some point. Yeah. That is not how to take that corner. Maybe I pit at the end of this lap and go to softs because I know that like by the third lap or about halfway through the third lap that the softs become moderate and then like right before the end of the third lap they hit uh, or sorry they hit minor about halfway through the third lap and then moderate right at the end um, so that might be the play because that would give me a whole extra lap on softs which would give me more time to try to make up ground. Yeah, I think that's what the guy in first place is doing, so we're gonna go ahead and do that too. Let's go ahead and get these softs on. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. If we can come out top 10, I would be happy with that. Especially if we come out in front of that KTM and that Ferrari. Okay. All right, P7. Now let's try to put down some good lap times with these softs on this rubbered in track. See if that was a good call. on the end of lap 7, still in P7. Closed the gap up to this NSX a little bit, but not quite enough to get into slipstream range. Uh, not sure what happened to that guy there, but there's a free position. Oh, I almost missed my braking point again. I gotta stop looking behind me right there.
can break later for that corner though. Uh-oh, that BMW's off. I think that was a little bit better three there. Alright, we are slowly starting to reel this NSX back in. drag race between the NSX's here. Alright, that puts us into a top 5, so that's actually a really, like, I'm happy with that result. Assuming that we can hold on to it here. Uh oh. I don't know what happened there. Well, that kind of puts us into a very comfortable P5 now. Which, I mean, I do think we would have pulled away from them anyway because of the soft tires and the low fuel and all that, but... That certainly helped. Alright, so we will bring home that P5, and uh, yeah, I mean, I would say that the hard to soft strategy might be the way to go on this track, to be honest. Um, and I mean, our pace was pretty good too. It looks like we were third fastest lap, if I'm not mistaken. Only one person quit the whole race? That's awesome. Well... You know what? I'm happy with that. That's a good first video back. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, I hope you'll leave it a like. If you are new around here, you haven't already, I would massively appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button. And, uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for me, guys. I hope to catch y'all in the next one.